Hey everyone, Surreal Canine here. Welcome back for more Disguise 3 Evil Academy Culture Fair. <clears throat> here we are, having just uh, gone through Master Big Star's Mado Cafe. Uh, I'm trying to keep these two apart now because obviously they want to do the thing. Ugh. Yeah. I've gone between them. Mission accomplished. Let's go interrogate the seniors. Oh man, it's a theater. Awesome. That dragon looks like he's having a lot of fun. The senior booth is a plague. What is this? As you can see, it's Romeo and Juliet. <laughs> okay then. We're not talking about the title. Although, after hearing it, the casting is extremely off. Extremely off? Are you blind? The parts couldn't have been played by anyone better. <laughs> huh? Wait, you there. Do you think our customers are content with your acting? Get serious. Romeo, channel your love into your fists and rocket punch Giulietti! Giulietti, counter with your mammary missiles and then say, Romeo, wherefore art thou so fat? <laughs> <laughs> oh man, it's a parody. Uh, what are you trying to do? Wait a minute, is this a comedy? I can't keep quiet any longer! I can't do rocket punches, dude! Don't order me to do things I can't do! You only can't because you think you can't. Put all your willpower into it. Otherwise, I'm casting a new Romeo! Whoa, whoa, whoa! That's physically impossible, dude! If anyone can do it, I'll be more than happy to switch! Is that so? Then I shall play Romeo. Oh man. Big Star gonna do rock punch. What the? <laughs> you pitiful subordinate Prinny. You dare defy my absolute orders? Okay then. I shall punish you before you quit. <laughs> I think we annoyed the customers. Alright, let's see what we got here. Ally damage. Invincibility. Uh, stuff. Okay. Okay, sure. It's, it's a thing. A thing is what we are doing here, guys. There's a thing. Gotta get the thing. Mr. Moon, Memphis, Romeo, Giulietti. <laughs> Let's check their. Uh... <laughs> Heavy stance, okay. She's trying really hard. <laughs> It's a tree. He always wanted to be a tree. Happy to become a tree. <laughs> These other guys are just kind of there. Okay. Let's get him, guys. Woohoo! Rock punch. <laughs> yeah, it's late at night. Can you tell? I am having some very surreal dance? commentary here. But you know, they call me Surreal Canine for a reason. Let's, uh, let's do the thing. Or the thing, the thing, and the thing. Right. 
Just kind of uh, checking my computer here in case Fox comes back and wants to do the thing. Forgive me. <laughs> Attack! Punisher! Oh no! Whoops! Not what I meant to target. Let's try that again with less fail. Smell you later. <laughs> that was not what was supposed to happen. That was incredibly bizarre, actually. Oh man, a new attack. Awesome. Kaboom! Ah, you missed! Alright, who do we have left here? Just these guys and the other guy. I forgot to uh, upgrade Salvatore's skills a little bit. Oh well. That didn't take too long. So the punishment for insubordination has been executed. Now, I shall assume the role of Romeo. You seem pretty obsessed with this Romeo part, but take a look around you. This show can't go on. <laughs> I think in addition to the orders, all of the cast have been executed. What a sight. Not only was the sole insubordinate punished, but the stagehands were also punished. <laughs> it's group responsibility. The customers who were quietly watching are just as guilty. Now they too are suffering the consequences. Well... The customer's job is to watch quietly. Who cares, huh? Now we know that the fool who plans to destroy the culture fair is not a senior. Come to think of it, that was the whole reason we're here. Not to replace Romeo. I almost forgot. <laughs> if he is not among the seniors, who is the culprit? Is it a teacher? Or... Could it be someone from outside the school? You must really not trust anyone at school. If you have time to think, then move! We shall move to plan B. Fighting spirit and guts will guide us. You call that a plan? Let's go! We shall find the culprit and make them pay for all the boosts that got ruined. Wasn't that you guys? Fool, trying to shift the blame away from yourself. You may not have noticed, but you're doing the same thing. <laughs> well then, that was a thing that happened. And I guess the NPCs still have nothing useful to say. Okay, see you guys next time.